Hello friends, in this video tutorial, we are going to discuss how to create a query in design view in open office base. Let's see with practical example here. Just open the open office and uh, select the database and uh, create a new database. Click on the next and then finish. Here you just specify the database name as a new database. 25 and whatever you want right here the database name and then click on the save okay and now new database 25 is created here and you will see this this table queries forms and report just click on the table because first of all we need to create a table and write the query for this table and now click on the create table in design view and uh, right here the field as a item id as in teaser okay and uh, item just item name as a text and uh, price of the item as an teaser okay just make the item id as a primary key and uh, save the table as a table one and uh, click on ok close it now i'm just going to enter the sum data for the item one table and right here code as a one and uh, data as a camera Price as a forty two thousand okay now enter the second record two iPad and uh, price as a twenty seven thousand okay and three as a calculator Just I expand it okay and now the calculator price as a ten thousand and four as a clock and price as a five thousand okay and uh, this is the data I have entered in my table and I want to write the query to select the data from 20,000 to 30,000. So in my case only one data iPad will be selected from the table or displayed from the table. Save the data and close it. So first of all I have created a table and entered the data in, in the table and now I'm just going to click on the query tab and create query in design view so click on the create query in design view and uh, it will display a dialog box add the table or query just select the table and uh, add it and now close it and this type of view you look here just select the field whatever you want to display just i have selected the item id then uh, second as a item and third is the price okay and we have three columns are filled item id item and item table pr uh, price item price and uh, now i'm just going to write the criteria just come to this row and price column and right here your criteria I'm just going to write here the condition like uh, greater than equals to 20,000 and uh, less than equals to 30,000 okay this is my criteria or condition 
the item selected from the table is equals to 20,000 or greater than 20,000 and less than or equals to 30,000. Now, you need to see, or uh, I'm just doing one thing, one more thing. Click here and uh, select the shorting here. Just, I am going to select the ascending order according to the item ID. Now, just save this query from here. Right here, the query name, I'm just leave it query one and then click on OK. I have created the query one and it will select the those items which price is equals to or greater than 20,000 and less than or equals to 30,000. Just close it and uh, this is my query. Double click here and uh, it will display the iPad the price come between 20,000 to 30,000. I just want to show you some more things. Okay, click on the table and double click. Just enter some more items as a five. And uh, suppose that uh, just right here a tablet and their price is uh, 23,000. Okay, and save it. Okay, now close it and go to query and click on query. It will display the tablet 23,000 because it come under the category of 20,000 greater than or equals to 20,000 and uh, less than equals to 30,000. Thank you friends. Please like and comment my video. Thanks for watching my video. Thanks a lot.